Hello, my dear students, and welcome to this week overview. During this week, we will be talking about carbon compounds. Our learning objectives identify the elements that carbon bonds with to make up life's molecule. Explain the functions of each of the four groups of macromolecules. Carbon is a fundamental element in life's molecules. Bonds with hydrogen, oxygen, nitrogen, and phosphorus to create the diverse array of organic compounds essential for living organisms. Hydrogen bonds with carbon to form hydrocarbons, providing energy and structure. Oxygen bonds with carbon in carbonyl groups found in sugars and organic acids, which are crucial and important for energy storage. Nitrogen forms bond with carbon in amines and amides present in proteins and nucleic acids, facilitating cellular functions. While phosphorus bonds with carbon in phosphate groups, vital for energy transfer in molecules like ATP. These molecules belong to four main groups of macromolecules, carbohydrates, lipids, proteins, and nucleic acids. Carbohydrates serve as energy sources and structural components, while lipids function in energy stores, storage, insulation, and cell membranes. Protein play roles in structure, catalysis, and cell signaling. Nucleic acids store and transmit genetic information, essential for protein synthesis and inheritance. Understanding the interactions between carbon and these elements, as well as the functions of macromolecule, is crucial in comprehending the basics of biology and biochemistry. As we said earlier, that this is the chemistry of carbon. We have here chain, ring, and branching. Then we have the macromolecules, as macromolecules are large organic molecules found in living things. We have monomers and we have polymer. Carbohydrate, that living things use carbohydrates as source of energy and for structural purposes. We have starch and glucose, starch being a polymer and glucose a monomer. Moving to the lipids. Lipids are a large and varied group of macromolecules that are not generally soluble in water. Moving to the nucleic acids that are polymers made of nucleotide monomers, we have phosphate group and we have also nitrogenous base and 5 carbon sugars. Proteins are polymers made of amino acid monomer. We have amino group and carboxyl group. We are going to discuss these and much more during the week.